What's up, I'm Tyler Casey, and today I'm gonna to be talking about a problem I've been seeing in the music video community and in the creative community on Instagram. Before I get into that, if you guys are new to the channel, here I post behind the scenes of the music videos I direct, I break down the lighting, and I talk about film gear. If you're a creative person like me, you most likely have an Instagram and use it to get your clients. I get tons of DMs a day asking how much I charge for my music video services. Probably over the last two years, I've had thousands of DMs of people just saying, how much are videos? The problem with these DMs is videos and music videos in general all cost different. It really depends on what you need. There really isn't a set number for a music video. The first thing you need to do is maybe give an example of what you're looking for. Hey, I really like what you did with this video. I kind of want to incorporate something like that into my video. The more details, the better, I always say. If you already have locations and ideas in mind, that's great. Definitely let the director know that. The more detailed, the better quote I can give you. So right now I'm gonna go on my phone and hit up some music video directors pretending I'm an artist. So the first one I'm gonna hit up, let's hit up my boy Rob Driscoll. So the first thing you wanna do is you wanna look at their page. So right here I see Rob Driscoll, California. He's a cinematographer, he has his email listed. And then we have shot by Rob Driscoll, hashtag. He's located in San Francisco. So if I'm located in New York, I'm already thinking, oh, I'm probably gonna have to play, I'm either gonna have to go out to San Francisco to shoot with this guy or fly him out to New York. So you should already be thinking about travel and stay. You're not just gonna message him, hey, how much for a video? Because already you know it's gonna cost a little bit more because you're all the way in New York. So if we wanted to be really professional, what we could do here is we could just click the email button right here on Instagram and we could type out an email to him. We could say, hey Rob, I wanted to see about shooting a music video with you. I attached the song below. I wanna film in a studio out here in New York. I will cover your flight. And the best thing you can possibly do for a music video is give a date. When you give someone a date, it definitely feels like you're gonna put things in motion. So if you have a date and you're really trying to shoot this video, definitely give the director a date so they can check their calendar or give them a handful of dates so you can get this video in motion. Let's peep my little homie shot by 806 Nick. All right, so we have Nick Buck Walter. He shoots full 4K Sony videos. Um, DM for serious inquiries. He used to have his price listed on here, but he does not do that anymore. So we see Nick has became a lot more professional. He wants to talk it up in the DMs and come up with a quote because Nick knows all music videos do not have a set price. It depends what you want. If you want Nick to strap his camera onto the front of your hood of your Maserati, he's gonna charge a little bit more because he's putting his camera at risk, he has to go get a car mount. There's a lot that goes into this. Definitely be as detail-oriented as you can and just be professional. My suggestion would be send a thorough email with about a paragraph of information, then go ahead and shoot them a DM and say, hey, I sent you an email, it's under this title, check it out and get back to me when you can, thanks. Okay, so we're looking at my homie Hatch86 Films. He's located in the Bay Area. He does music videos, live events, commercials, weddings, photography, and more. Check out his new video. Then right here, we can either text him or email him. So what you could do in this scenario is you could email him. You could type out your detailed response. You can attach the song you want to film for. Then you can maybe even shoot him a text and say, hey, I just shot you an email. I'm trying to shoot this video as soon as possible. Let me know your next available date. So it's pretty easy. Just take a little bit of extra time and people will take you a lot more serious. Especially if you want to reach out to bigger directors, you're definitely going to have to be a lot more professional in your manner. If you guys found this video helpful and you know someone who might need this information, make sure to share it with them. Comment below if you guys get DMs like this all the time. Make sure to check me out on Instagram at Tyler Casey Prod and feel free to DM me if you guys just watched this video. Make sure to subscribe and I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks.